if you look a little closer, you can see where the darker um, circles are. Those, that is my uterus. It is supposed to look also straight, but as you can see, there is a division right in the center of my uterus. I have a full septum and it was most likely the reason as to why I was losing my pregnancies. Didn't Questions? the doctor say it was like a miracle that he made it to 37 mm -hmm. weeks? Yeah. For now that they know the problem, can that like, uh, they can yeah. plan? Yeah, they actually were able to see that I'm a perfect candidate to have it fixed. Cool. Oh, so that's right. amazing. So nice. All my doctors have agreed it is time to do surgery. We need to remove the septum and just hopefully hope for the best and maybe that'll help with my future pregnancies. Good morning, you guys. Today is the big day. We got Cassie and her friends who are gonna watch Ollie, and Missy's mom is actually gonna drive us to the hospital because last night I broke out in hives, and so I have Benadryl, and I don't want to fall asleep all day. It's, he's got everything. It's really bad. It's everywhere. It's really itchy and uncomfortable. Hey, Superman. We gotta go. I love you. Mama's gonna have a surgery. Have a good day. Good kiss. <laughs> love you. Well, yeah, I was, I didn't He's a little Superman. Look at his hair, babe. He woke up literally just looked like. Really? It wasn't like a crazy mess? That's how I woke up. Oh my gosh. Alright, take care of him, you guys. I didn't make oatmeal. <laughs> Alright, today is the day. We are headed out to the hospital. I'm getting my surgery. I definitely didn't sleep great last night. I had a lot of like bad dreams, a lot of, I think, you know how when you go in like half sleep, half awake, and you're kind of stressed and out, and I gotta tell you, poop. <laughs> I'm just gonna say that, like I was so stressed all night that that's pretty much my life. Get the nervous poo. I had the nervous poo. <laughs> that's really gross. Yeah, so today is the big day. I am slightly nervous. I'm just mainly nervous. When you get into a hospital, it just becomes really like real and it, like a lot of emotions and I actually already have anxiety when I go into hospitals because not a lot of great things have happened to me in hospitals except for that I had a baby one time <laughs> but the other times have not been wonderful and so even when I walk into like a doctor's office and I see an ultrasound machine my heart like will stop and I'll like get really stressed out I'm just kind of like not looking forward to like the realness of it all but I'm excited to get the surgery over with. That's what I'm excited for. I know a lot of people are new and I get questions all the time. Why are you having a surgery? What's wrong with you? I'm gonna have all the videos linked below. I've talked. I've been talking about this for over a year now. It is a big deal. This is kind of like my entire future right here. I kinda, at this point, told myself if for any reason something happens and like they make it so I can't have babies anymore I would rather that than to go through another pregnancy and possibly lose another baby although I don't think that anything's gonna happen I think that they're gonna fix me up and I'm gonna have great successful pregnancies after this I guess at this point I'm willing to risk it because I just can't go through any more losses if you guys are wondering any more what is going on just check the links down below watch some videos and you'll probably figure it out pretty easily but yeah, it's happening today. We're getting the surgery and I'm gonna have more babies. Yay! Well, don't you look attractive. Why do I make so skinnier? <laughs> <laughs> You've got a nice warm blanket. They just offered to blow up warm air in your uh, gown, which I is a thing. No, I didn't want warm air. <laughs> Please, no gown. thank you. <laughs> Next is the IV. I'm all nervous about it. You'll be okay. Look at this bad boy. You're such a trooper, babe. So, sometimes well, one time when they did an IV, it took like six times, and it was like the worst experience of my life. But this time, she numbed my hand. Yeah, Who gave her a little prick. Like, <laughs> duh, like why should, we should have been doing that forever ago. And then she just stuck it in, it was no big deal. I still, I get really like, you don't I don't like get looking it. at yeah. it. I'm really weird that there's like a tube inside my vein right now. Yeah, we do have Missy's mom here. She's holding yes. on to the rings. Yes. 
Brian and I are engaged. I get, <laughs> yeah, I get I'm very, now engaged to your mom. How does that make you feel? <laughs> yeah, I get very emotional if like my mom or Brian isn't here. Like they both have to be here at all times. So at one point they only, like Brian had to come back here without my mom and I started getting like really panicky. Like. I don't know. You're I'm gonna really, be okay, babe. I'm really attached to these people. <laughs> You're gonna be okay. Look at this cute little paw you got on your gown. Yep. That's cool. It's almost. You almost look as cute as this thing right here. Do you mm -hmm. see that? That's way cuter. I want that one. There's a little puppy dog in a gown. Cassie just sent this picture of Ollie. <laughs> he says, "Good luck and I love you, mom." Thank you. So cute. It made me happy. <laughs> Like a big sweet tea. Yeah, this is good time to ask. Now she'll say, "Yeah, sure, honey." I love this hat on you, babe. Thank you. It looks great. Got a little bit of medicine in me. She's got a nice little cocktail. They're getting you all ready. I'll take good care of her, mom and husband. We'll see you in a little bit. Love you. Love you, baby. Have a nice nap. You do good, okay? Come back with a little less. <laughs> All right, so she just went in. She was feeling pretty anxious, um, and I think she's feeling a lot better now. They gave her a little cocktail before she went in, so shouldn't be too much longer now. Um, they said about 30 minutes to an hour, but I haven't been eating with her because I didn't want to like eat in front of her, so I'm starving. So hopefully we can find food before she gets out, and hopefully it goes smoothly, which I think it will. Look who's awake. Hey, babe. You're here. Welcome back to the Earth. How do you feel? Okay, I feel crampy. They put like that thing in my throat to help me breathe and so I have, like, it feels swollen. Yeah, it's like that really uncomfortable feeling, huh? Yeah, it feels like it's hard to swallow and stuff. And um, But you're done. You did it. Yep. It was scary, but got it over with. So the doctor came out to, uh, I was actually sleeping. I was using Missy's clothes as a pillow on the couch in the waiting room and the doctor came out um, and basically said that he got like the whole thing. They showed us some pretty crazy pictures too we might show you guys but you have like a normal uterus now babe. Yep. Hopefully we'll see how recovery goes. Yeah we'll see how and the, we'll, they'll be doing another ultrasound to like just check everything in like four weeks or so. Yeah. But um they said that I do have a small dip, like it's just like a natural dip in my uterus. So they got like as close as they could to that and yeah. feels very confident that I, he was able to get everything. That's crazy. That's cool. That's why we did this. I'm so happy for you, baby. I'm so proud of you. Yeah. You did good. Now she's hungry. I'm sorry. I haven't, it's, do you want some pumpkin bread? <laughs> it's 5 o'clock. I haven't eaten anything since last night, like 11.30. Yeah, they won't let her eat. So. We're going to try and break her out of here, but hospitals take forever. So Missy was on her little cocktail when they were bringing you back. Mm -hmm. And apparently you were telling the, the anesthesiologist about your YouTube channel. <laughs> yeah, I just, I don't remember how I brought, I must have just been like, I'm on YouTube. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know you're so full of yourself. Yeah, I was like, and I think he might have asked like what, what we, maybe like what Brian does or something. I was like, oh, we have a YouTube channel. And he was like, oh, okay, what do you do? And I was just like, vlog of life. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oh, I'll, I'll look you up. I was like, yeah, today will be on there. <laughs> so He'll funny. never find it. No. With the way she was talking. No, yeah. I, was, I, I don't remember why I was talking about it, but... <laughs> We're just waiting yeah. to go home. I'm just, I'm very crampy. Oh, show I, that picture. Cassie's watching Ollie, though, and she's been sending us some cute pictures, including this one. <laughs> look at that. He's in the cupboard. Oh, I miss him already. He looks so different with his haircut, babe. No, he really does. And finally, we're home. We're home. Do you care? Do you care? Hi, did you miss us, boy? Hi. Oh, yes, we're home. We're just chilling on the couch. And she's relaxing, acting all cool. How you feeling, babe? Um, I'm really crampy and painful, but... Overall, I'm just ready to go to bed. Yeah, it's been a really long day of waiting and waiting and waiting some more. Hospitals just make yeah. you wait too much. Um, my surgery was at 1, and I didn't even get it until like 2. Yeah. And then it just took forever and getting out of there forever, so Ollie's already in bed. Yeah, we didn't get to see Ollie when we came home, which was a bummer. I was really looking forward to hugging him, but it's okay. I guess it's probably for the best since I don't really 
have the energy to like run after him. You yeah, know? totally. He's asleep and we are just relaxing. If you guys didn't know, Missy actually put out her very first baking video on her channel. She's gonna be doing them every Friday. So she put a new one out yesterday and it's her famous pumpkin bread. So if you guys wanna see how she does it or make it yourselves or just check it out, we edited and shot it like really differently and cool. And I think it's really awesome. So if you guys wanna watch that, I'll have a link below in the description. But if you guys enjoyed this vlog, click thumbs up, leave a happy comment below and we will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Beach blonde hair, oh my gosh. I'll do it short. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. What do you think, Missy? Where are we gonna go? <laughs> he oh looks like God. a little boy now. Oh okay. my gosh. Like a teenager. Look at this. <laughs> He's so cute. Look at his cute little hair. What do you think, Cassie? I love it, except he looks way older now. He does, he looks like a little boy.